In this tutorial, we want to look at how to stroke a selection. I'm using Game 2.10.22. So I have a, a an image here that I downloaded from Pixabay and I have it open here. You see two others, but I've closed it. These are duplicates in case something should go wrong. And now I have this and I want to um, put something like a, a stroke around this uh, the this ob, uh, subject here so what i would um, i would do first is i want to get rid of the background so i can go, i'm going to use since it's a simple background i'm going to use the fastest select tool other than that i would have used the path tool or any other selection tool adequate for my photo and now i come here and i have i put a, a, a nascent and feather edges so that when i do it i don't have these sharp edges i the radius i maintain it as it is i'll be adjusting the threshold as i see how it's selected so i i, I have a threshold of 20.6 and it works perfectly well if yours is not working you just adjust let's see here. if i adjust this you see it goes in too much and then when i'm here as well uh, actually 18 0.5 also is good it's actually does a good job as well so i'll maintain it as it is here and then what i would do is that i just want to delete the background here but i i don't know what is because i i don't it's a j a pack image so i just want to put an alpha channel in so i just go to my layer right click and then i do add alpha channel so that's when i do the deletion it would be really um the background will be deleted to um something empty now i can either press my keyboard delete keyboard sign to get this off or i can just also go to edit and clear and then it clears the background nicely for me now remember the selection is was for this side here so for me to get a selection of this i go again to select and then I do invert so that's now I know I have selected this now what I want to do is I want to stroke put a stroke around this um, object here uh, I would first of all maybe do a duplicate of it um, and then I would because m most of the time I prefer doing duplicates of things and then uh, I go here and then I, I now go to um edit and then stroke selection because i want to put a selection a, a stroke there it depends on the color i'll just use the color that is taken is what um what is on the foreground you can choose the for uh, change the foreground color by just pressing this and choosing any color you like i maintain it to five and then i would choose a solid color you can also choose a pattern but i choose a solid color and i maintain this here and i listen so that it's smooth it's not like um hard at the edges and then i'll just introduce a line of width of five and so um you can also stroke with a, a a paint tool if you want but i will just maintain it with a, a stroke uh, with this one here and then i do stroke so now you can see that this object has been stroked with this if i go out of it if i go to um select none you see that it has been stroked nicely so this is how you can use this this was a short one thank you for watching if this helped you in any way please help me by subscribing to my channel or giving this video a like thank you bye